Tonight, a massive cybercrime bus is keeping you a bit safer online, but the threat isn't over or gone yet. Yeah, not just yet. Just hours ago, Georgia's attorney general announcing that the state is now working with the FBI to crack down on online crime. 11 Alive's John Sherrick joins us now with how you can find out if your personal information is at risk. How big is this FBI cybercrimes bust? It's a very big thing that's just happened in the last 24 to 48 hours. Kunal Anand, the chief technology officer for the cybersecurity firm Imperva, says for the past four to five years, the cyber criminals who have just been arrested by the FBI were operating an actual marketplace called the Genesis Market, buying and selling the personal data from millions of computers infected with malware, data that allowed them to log into personal accounts and steal billions of dollars. However, these arrests will not change the fact that you may have malware still. They won't change the fact that those credentials are somewhere out there. Easy pickings for cyber criminals who have not been caught yet. I could empty out a bank account. I could empty out a savings account. Uh, they could empty out a retirement account. Dr. Andy Green, cybersecurity professor with Kennesaw State University, applauds the FBI for the arrests, and he's glad that the state attorney general is now going after the cyber criminals still operating out of Georgia, because otherwise... There will be another criminal actor group that will engage in the same behaviors. The state attorney general is providing a link to check if your computer has been compromised. Just type in your email address, and instantly you can see any threats and find out how to remove them including signing up for a password manager and using double authentication, not a password alone, to thwart the cyber criminals. They don't have the ability to get the, the one-time token that, that, uh, that's being sent to you either by SMS or via your authenticator apps. 99 times out of 100, that's going to protect you from, uh, from a successful attack. Protection from cyber criminals trying to profit from stolen personal data. In Atlanta, John Shearick, 11 Alive News.